There's a box in the park. There are marks on the box. It's hidden in the dark, so you can't see the locks. Just another day in the park. There's a spark in the dark, which lights up so bright. Bark to the fox as it barks in the night. Just another day in the park. There are locks on the box with the guardian's mark. High in the sky, see the flight of the lark. Just another day in the park. Is it possible the other one could be Mark? Why? Because they're my niece and nephew who are staying with me, and they're twins. Could they be the children of Heritron from the legend? It cannot be. They're not from Heritron. They're from this world, Earth. Agree, but they're the same family. They, like me, are descended from the original Guardian. It could be, but we must be absolutely certain. One thousand before. Remember the original guardian who hid the box wrote these in Roman times. We must look up the numbers in your Roman Britain. We have to look it up. You want to spell petrified, look it up. You want to find out when Julius Caesar died. Look it up. To know how Romans built roads, moved heavy loads, or wrote letters in codes, look it up. If you want to find out anything, look it up. It's all inside a book. All you have to do is look, look it up. The Romans came, but why and when? How did they write? Or count to ten? Look it up. It's all inside a book. All you have to do is look, look it up. Now let's see. Roman numbers. Roman numbers. Ah, here we are. Five is V, ten is X, fifty is L, a hundred is C, and a thousand is M. So a thousand before means putting M before the word Ark. We were right. The poems do mean Mark and Lisa. They are the children of Heritron, the ones who will find the keys to the box. But how? I do not know. But the legend cannot be wrong. Children, uh, we have a problem. It's that box, isn't it? Yes. It isn't just a box, it's a doorway. A doorway? Into another world. A world called Heritron. Uh, sit down. Um, that box was locked shut and hidden here almost 2,000 years ago by someone known as the First Guardian. Uh, ever since then, we have sought to keep the box from those who want it opened. Who's we? I am the latest in a long line of guardians. What would happen if the box was opened? Then some very determined people from Heritron would come through to this world. Who are they? They're called the Catchers, and that's what they do, catch. What do they catch? Slaves. The Catchers are sent by the Takers who rule all of Heritron. It's a beautiful but menacing world. The Takers themselves used to live in luxury in grand castles with fine clothes and servants. But now their world is in decline and there's decay and ruin everywhere. And to support the way they live, they depend on a constant supply of slave workers to operate their machines. Well, they plunder other worlds to get those slaves. And once they've brought them back to Heritron, they soon forget where they came from. If the box is opened, 
Then the takers will send the catchers through to Earth in their search for more slaves. But if the box is hidden to stop it being opened, now it's been found Professor Waters will open it. And these uh, catchers will come through. Oh, well, fortunately, it isn't that easy. You see, there's only one way to open that box, and the professor won't know how to do that. This is most unusual. There doesn't appear to be any way of opening it. Professor, I was just wondering, these markings, could they have something to do with opening it? Yes. Yes, of course! The box can only be opened with three keys, but the first guardian hid them so that the doorway would never be opened. Hid them where? Ah, no one knows. The secret died with him. Well, if they're lost, then everything's all right. The box will stay shut. Ah, yes, but now that the box has been found, there's every danger that the keys will be found, too. Now, what we've got to do is make sure that we're the ones to find them. Well, Janus, what have you to report? Supreme One. The box has been discovered. At last. Have you opened it? Have you opened the doorway? Not yet, Eminence. But it will be soon. We have only ten of your days, Janus, remember. After that, the worlds will be too far apart for us to come through. Trust me, Eminence. After all this time, all these years of searching, now that we have found the box, I will not let you down. I'm telling you both because it appears that you two are vital to solving the problem. We are? But how? I don't exactly know yet, but if you two are involved, then you could be in serious danger. Danger? So what can we do? Well, we must study the box to see if somehow it can lead us to the three keys. I doubt Professor Waters will let you anywhere near it. Ah. Then we must go when the Professor isn't around. The box has been found. But not the keys, Your Eminence. Janus will find them using this Professor Waters. I am more concerned about the rebel Anna. There is no news of her. Nor her daughter. They have vanished. They must be in hiding somewhere. We must find them. I think this one might be open. I don't think so. Let me. Mr. Gardner, caught red-handed, like a thief in the night.